Hey everybody, Brett from Stardust Gaming here, back with part 3 of our Cortex Command Let's Play. And so we're right back where we left off last time, although we seem to have acquired a lot more money than I recall. Um, I'm not sure how that happened, but I'm not going to question it. Now, before we dive in, I just want to say, um, the last episode didn't get as much interest I guess as I thought it would um, so I thought about canning or at least postponing the series in favor of something else um, I almost ended up doing an arc series because I mean you know God knows they need another arc series on YouTube but uh, um, between the the fact that there's already a bajillion of them on YouTube and I really don't feel like throwing my hat in that ring and um, the fact that it really, it plays okay on my computer, but when I throw recording software into the mix, it, the you know, the frame rate starts to drop. Um, the test recording I did got a bunch of, like, screen tear and stuff going on in it. Um, and so, yeah, I mean, I, I'm playing the game in my own time, and I do enjoy it. Um, do not buy it if you don't have an awesome computer and a lot of patience. Um, it's just not ready yet. Not ready at all. Um, good concept though, but yeah, so I was thinking about doing an arc, an arc survival evolve series, probably not going to happen after what the test footage looked like, but yeah, it doesn't seem like there's a lot of people interested in Cortex Command, which is a shame because I really enjoy this game and I'd like to finish this campaign and, you know, maybe even do another modded one, but you know, if nobody's interested, I'm not going to, I'm not going to force it. Um... But yeah, so this is going to be sort of Cortex Command's last little shot. Um, if it tanks as bad as it did for the last episode, I'm going to try to find something to replace it with. I don't know what. Um, I don't know. Definitely throw me some suggestions if there's something you'd rather see than this. But um, yeah, I, I do like playing this game, and so I'd like to continue doing that. But obviously, I can do that in my own time if there's something that you guys would enjoy more than this. So, that being said, let's go ahead and jump in. And so we have a pretty significant advantage now that we have all this money. And I kind of feel bad, but there's really nothing I can do unless I, like, go back and, like, cheat engine it, maybe. I'd have to reinstall cheat engine. But, yeah, we're just going to roll with it. Um, most of the times the bugs go... You know, out of my favor. So when they're going toward, when they're going for me, I'm not gonna question it. So let's jump in. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. So there's our brain. Let's get to uh, defending here. What do we got going on? Oh. Come on, wing him in the head, there we go. Uh, a couple of those hit him in the face. There we go. So what do we got going on here? Um, I don't like how exposed that brain is right there. Oh, blow that up, please. I don't know how he survived that, but his gun really sucks. Let's see if we can like pummel him to death or something. Ah, that's frustrating. This guy's gonna have to plug this gap here. So let's put him on sentry mode, and you know we should probably start spending some of these funds, huh? Let's go buy. Uh, we're gonna do the heavies right off the bat because why not? We got the money. And guns, you know, the flamethrowers kicked some serious butt last time, so. I'm thinking we go heat lances. And we'll do two at a time because, you know, we got the money. I should probably get back to checking on this stuff before we get killed. There we go. He's still alive. You're still alive. That's good. Come on. You know what? This will be easier. Oh, we got another guy. No, 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 no. This one. Okay. 
Let's get busy with this flamethrower. And we actually should have brought him with us. Let's do that. We'll form up a squad and go in. Okay, are you recharged? Up and over. There we go. Okay, form squad. And then you just drag this. So we'll just take these two. And, oh, great, dead end. So, let's make sure we're not getting killed on this side. Uh, we're pretty well defended, actually. Um, that sniper is dead, though. Uh, no, we need to back you up. Ah, there. Let that door close. Okay, so what are we going to do with these guys? They're kind of stuck on the wrong side. And I didn't give them a digger or anything. Otherwise, you know, we just kind of punch our way through. I don't think the flamethrower is going to do much to this. Yeah... Not really much at all there. Hmm. Well. Let's see if we can't go the other way. And I think I broke up my squad on accident there. Oh, these controls. It's not, I mean, like, they're just kind of clunky, but as you saw in the last episode, it can make for some, like, really fun, hectic experiences. But it can also be extremely frustrating. Um, something's going on over here. They don't seem to be able to get in. No, go up. Ah, you know what? We're just buying new ones. We got the money. Where do we want to be? Down here? You know what? Before we do that... Oh, uh, jeez. Can I cancel this? I don't think I can cancel this. Oh, I just did. Okay. Before we do that, let's make sure at least one of them, if not both, have diggers. So, we'll just throw a medium digger on him. And we'll call him in... Right here, I guess. And we'll just have extra defense next time, I, I suppose. Here it comes. And he got a little bit hurt from that, but hopefully not too bad. Okay, so we'll go right through here. Wow, there was some chaos down here. And let's have you join up. And, wow, he didn't get very far. We should actually be able to just, like, kind of uproot him right here. Oh, jeez. Did you lose your gun? I think you lost your gun. Okay. So, oh, there he is. Let's just go for the dig kill. There it is. Right in the head. So, very, very sloppy, but we got the win. And I suppose that's all that matters. So we'll hold on to the Yiskali Mountains, or however the hell you pronounce that. And then yellow and blue are going to fight over Ravar Tundra. And we'll kind of just let that happen, I guess. It's a new day. New incomes. We'll skip this. You guys know the drill by now. We'll get things moving. How do we want to spend this? No new... No new... Um, strongholds or I don't know what to call them really no capture points I guess so it might be smart for us to do another defensive thing here we'll just throw like 1500 into every base and the new one will get a little bit extra and we'll go defense here and then I assume next turn they'll introduce another capture point in which case we'll go a little bit more on the offensive but let's just uh do a little bit of wait and see right here. 14 items there. What do we get here? 12. And this one should be a bunch. Because that's a lot of money. Ah, oh, 13. It must have been 13 really good items. Because each one was over. Okay, what's going on here? Uh, wow, they are going all in on this one. So let's see what happens. We got a bunch of flamethrower dudes hanging out here, so let's just kind of spread out. Where are they? They're like right in between here somewhere. Oh, he doesn't have a gun or arms really, so. 
can you somebody would they like trying to climb through the window that's kind of ridiculous oh damn this reload come on fire 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 there And reload, please. Okay, you. Oh, if we could get that heavy pistol, that'd be pretty awesome. Because I think he still has one limb he can operate that with. If he can get there. Yep. Sweet. Oh, he's got a pull sticker. Let's grab that, too. And... We'll just grab him as well. Can we get up there? Yes, we can. Where are they? Oh, we can't shoot through that. No. Oh, he's he's dead meat. Just like that guy. <laughs> wow, that was messy. Oh, they're kind of out of range. Jeez. They are tearing us up over there. I think I've got def defilade from them right here. Oh, man. They are coming in droves. Let's uh, put some fire on them from here. I really can't see what I'm doing. These stupid, like, blockade things are just awful. Awful, awful, awful. Uh, I think they might try to go through here. Oh, God, no, my brain. Defend the brain at all costs. I really need to buy stuff right now, but I don't have the money. Oh, jeez. I can't see where I'm aiming. It kind of sucks. Oh, reload faster, please. I wish he had a better gun. This is going to be a really hard defense with such a crappy gun. No, no, no. Too far down. Too far down. Okay, we got him. Very nice. That is an awful place for a brain. Let me just say that that is one of the worst places for a brain I've ever seen. Uh, we could really use you upstairs, buddy. But you're too fat to fly. Perfect. Well, he's goner. Oh, is there a Gatling gun down there? Damn it. No, why would you switch that way? Oh, God. Okay, well, you survived somehow. I can't figure out, like, where they are. They're, like, really well dug into that mountain or something. God damn it. There we go. Okay. You have nothing but a pistol. Oh, brain is gone. Run, 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 run. Oh, Jesus. No. That's, yeah, that's it. Damn it. Well, they're going to inherit a really poorly designed base. So, good luck to them. we got a couple more battles going on here. So this is just going to be all action. Okay, so blue's going to go. Oh, I can't see. Oh, there it is. Okay, so not too bad. Um, let's throw this, like, in the middle or something. It's not going to block anything. Uh, well, here we go. We'll see how well this base is designed. Um, okay. So we got a free moving brain. Let's have him on auto dig. We got some random dude just kind of hanging out here. So let's uh, back these guys up. To about here, I suppose. 
And I'm going to have you ambush anybody that comes down that little thing right there. Like right here maybe. And you should really be here where you can actually do something. Let's put you on sentry mode as well. You on sentry mode. This one's much better designed and much better defended. He's actually burying himself in too. That's pretty pretty smart of him. So now it's just a matter of being able to buy stuff. So let's call in... Uh, I wish it wouldn't reset all the time. Let's call in a heavy with... We'll do a light digger. And... Um, the heat lance is pretty solid. So let's do that. The range isn't very good on it. I can't, I can't afford it. Oh, I need to we'll do a drop crate. Where's their guy? He's down here. Okay. Well, let's drop in right here. And we'll let them kind of take on our defenses, however they so choose, while we... Why, why would you switch? I didn't even hit the button. Can you... Thank you. Oh, jeez, jeez, jeez. What was that? <laughs> I don't know what that weapon was, but it just wrecked him. Um, we'll call in another one, I guess. Same plan, but we won't get headshotted this time. Immediately. Are they coming? Yep, they're coming. Yeah, he didn't stand much of a chance. All this, this guy took a little bit of fire there. Okay, there he is. I don't know what that guy's goal is, but he's going about it a very interesting way. Maybe we can go through here. Oh, that's a flamethrower, isn't it? No, that's a flamethrower. So, why aren't we digging through this? I don't remember the light digger sucking this bad. What's going on here? Hmm, maybe if we go... What's down here? Ooh, that might be even easier. Get some gold for that. Yeah, that was weird. It wasn't really... I don't, Maybe it was the material. There's a lot of rocks in that. So maybe the light digger just can't handle that kind of terrain. Because it's tearing through this pretty easily. And we're getting gold, actually. Um, but I'm just going to dig right up under him. And he's not going to be able to do much about it. Although I do need to be careful if you... Oh, he's building right there. I can see it. Let's uh, get over this rock. you got to kind of be careful because you can't exactly you know, climb up a hole in this game. So... If you're not building at a decent slope, you'll just get stuck. And one downside to these flamethrowers is they do not puncture... They don't, they don't go through uh, dirt, so you gotta dig all the way through like I did right there. But there's another successful defense. I don't think they did really anything to our base. And hopefully the the next one's against somebody else, because we are really getting pummeled here. Nope. Another Yet another assault against us. Wow. You're going to throw 38 ounces at me? I, I mean, other than the, the starting troops, I don't know what they'll even be able to muster for this. Wow, this is a pretty ornate looking base here. Can you... Damn it. Not very well designed, though. He needs to be able to dig for gold and get as low as possible. And this is like super reinforced whatever right here. Um, I'm just going to put you on like auto dig. Just do something for me, man. Um, you need to be up here because otherwise you're just target practice. Reload. Stand up faster. Oh, God, we grazed his head. 
He's totally gonna wing us. There. Oh, there's another one. Reload. Okay, that's a pretty good spot right there. Put you on... What's it called? Uh, sentry duty. You're kind of stuck. Yeah, there's like awkward dirt spots right here. Can I get out now? Come on. Go, 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 go. Nice. No, maybe not. Okay. Sort of out. What kind of gun is this? Is this the incendiary rifle? I should probably grab that scouting rifle and just like pick him off with it. Frag nailer. That's That sounds pretty cool. Um, but we're back at our base, so I think they are the other direction. But there was like a mountain there, so that's not going to work. Let's charge up a little bit. And can we make it? Nope. So how do we want to do this? I guess he's just going to have to be defense. We'll just put him right here on sentry mode, and anybody that jumps down there is going to get shot in the face. And let's call in... Please stop reverting. Uh, they're trying to dig down or something above me, aren't they? Tools, medium digger, guns, heat lance. Delivered on a drop crate, because why the heck not? Uh, let's go right here. He wants to build a heavy-duty base. We'll just go right around it. No reason to dig through that concrete. Okay. Yeah, so if you're not landing on snow, they do... Why does it keep switching on me like that? If you're not landing on snow, they do take a little bit of damage um, from the fall. But we're just going to go right through here. Hopefully right on his head. Yep. And that's another win. He went for the gold instead of the the kill, and it cost him. Although he had a, quite a ways to go, regardless. All right, and that, so that's the end of a pretty hectic day, but we managed to kill off a lot of brains. I think everybody lost at least, at least one. They lost quite a few, and they lost at least two. We're still at 17. So day seven. I'm going to check the time really quick because I think I let it get away from me a little bit. Um, but we should still have a little bit of time left, so I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, and so we're at like 23 and a half minutes, so we've got a little bit of time left, but not a lot. So let's just see what happens. Um, ooh, a new thing. So we'll probably go after that one, I think, although I really do want to take these back. It just, we've built a pretty substantial base there, and they managed to take it back from us, or take it from us, so I don't know how well defended it'll be. Yeah, so let's see. Let's see how the income shake out first, and then we'll decide. So we're at 3,800. They're at 3,000. They're at 3,300. Um, green's pretty broke. I think we should go after them. But before I do that, I should probably adjust my budgets here. I'd kind of like this to be at least a thousand and we'll just make this a thousand as well uh, wow this is such so uh, I don't know what the word is it's it's like impossible to drag and then you drag it you finally get it to drag and it goes like way further than you intended to um, yeah so let's pour the rest in here I don't know that we really need to bother scanning, but the thing with the thing with attacking other bases is actually sometimes easier because you start with units rather than having to buy them all. Um, so yeah, you generally don't need as much money at the beginning as long as you can get a good foothold. Um, but yeah, obviously we're not gonna have time to do that battle today, so I'll probably break it off right here, um, and we'll see if we can't take back the East Glee Mountains in the next episode. Oh, and I forgot. We're, we're going to have to probably... We'll let them sort this out among themselves, and then we'll come in and hit whoever wins it, I think. But yeah, going to break the off, break off the episode. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you back here for potentially part four of our Cortex Command Let's Play.